Here's how you can quickly make flashcards using ChatGPT. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Junius, I am soon to be a final year medical student in New Zealand, and in this video, I'll just go over how I quickly make flashcards using ChatGPT. So, why do? Let's say I want to memorize this body of text. It's on uh, type 2 diabetes. All I have to do is copy and paste it into ChatGPT, so I'll just highlight it, Control or Command C, and then Control and Command V here eventually. But what I'll do is I'll write the prompt of turn turn the this into high yield flash cards for a medical student. Obviously, you don't have to use medical student, whatever student you are, or whatever context you need flashcards for. You can just write that. Command or Control V. Let ChatGPT do its magic. And then it'll just make flashcards for me. And then I can just copy and paste these into my flashcard software of choice. I currently have been using Notion Toggle more and more as opposed to Anki when I make my own flashcards. So what I'll do is, let's say this was a blank page, forward slash and then toggle, toggle list. And then I'll just copy and paste this as the question, command V, click that, and then the answer is here, and paste. And it's ultimately a flashcard, but it's Notion toggle and it's more linear, so I can categorize where the information is in my head a lot easier than I would if I had to use Anki, I think. But I still use Anki as well, it depends on the situation. And I can just do this. Now, a few points I want to make if you decide to do this method to make flashcards quicker. I still think after doing this for a bit, there are a few things which I think are high yield in here, which ChatGBT might not make flashcards for. So I just go through and double check everything. Also, there are a few occasions where ChatGBT may misinterpret something in the passage. And that's quite rare, but overall I don't want to be memorizing information that's incorrect for medical school. So I'll just go over and make sure everything's you know, somewhat sound and accurate from my understanding. But that's really how I do it. And then you can make these into Notion toggles or Anki flashcards, whatever floats your boat. So yeah, I just double check everything. But thanks for watching. Uh, my name is Junius uh, and I'll see you in the next one.